Oh god. Oh god, what was that? Oh my god, what was that? Oh. 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 Ah! See, this is why I have no friends. Hello guys, and welcome to this mod showcase. Uh, I'm True Nightmare, and um, yeah, I'm doing this on a special map. It was made by this guy, Kralis. Um, his mountain house. I'm going to be using this as my mod house for now because it's the best house I've seen. Um, and today we are doing the Balkans weapon mod, which is in Tekkit. Um, I've put myself down here for a reason. Um, and as I walk up to the house, I'll explain what it is. Well, the Balkans weapon mod adds loads of new weapons, which you might have seen on my inventory just a few seconds ago, uh, to Minecraft. And um, yeah, I like this mod very much because it, it seems Minecrafty, if you know what I mean. It's not like they've added machine guns and shotguns and stuff like that into the game. It's simple weapons that would fit into the game, but I wouldn't use them if they were probably I'd, I'd prefer them as a mod, but I, they they would fit in the game. And uh, there's a the piggy, a little piggy. He's on the live stream on this house build, which you can actually go on. No, you can actually get the guy's channel. I'll post the guy's channel who built this in the uh, description. And I'll also put the mod in the description. But um, yeah, we're still going up to the house. It's quite a nice house. I like this house. That's why I downloaded and started changing few things. There we go. Um, why is this door open? Um, yes. So, this is my little testing area. This is a test certificate. I'm going to test on him. Um, I've got all the crafting recipes here. There's a spear. Uh, you can use any uh, whatever these are called. Ores like diamonds, wood, stone and uh, thingamajiggy whatever they're called. So, um, yeah. You can stab him with the spear. We can throw the spear at him. You do have to go get it though, which I can't be asked to go do. Um, there's the knife, which is actually used in a few crafting recipes. You can stab them, which I just spawned another one. You can stab them, or you can lob it at them. Uh, that's very handy if you've like not got that many hits in your knife left and again you gotta go get it but <laughs> yeah I don't want to wrestle them out there's the uh, halibur which I'm not sure I'm not sure the damage value of any of these weapons I just know they're pretty good seems to have a very long range though this one and a knockback which is quite cool um, it's not throwable you do get that weird defense sort of thing if you press the right click so I'll put that one back. There's the iron axe, and if you're wondering, these are the crafting recipes. Uh, the iron battle axe. And you're too far away! But, um... Yes, this... See, it does knock back, but they're not coming towards me, so I'm gonna have to... recheck that. Um... This is the iron warhammer. It's uh, like does not back. I think all these do not back. And oh wow, oh wow! I don't know what that was. Seems like a hammer of god sort of shit going on here. Um, let's put that back before I start destroying the building. Uh, <laughs> this is an iron flatel, which. Okay, it's sort of like a fishing rod. Yeah, okay, it's just a ball you throw. So it's basically a very powerful fishing rod. Um, if you like to go fishing. But it's obviously not for fishing, it's for beating people to death. And that would be all the melee weapons in this mod. Uh, not a lot, but it's worth looking at. Um, there's different misc weapons. This is the boomerang, which 
you throw and I completely fucked that up. Um, <laughs> you know, I'll go test it up here. I've got some dummies up here that I can test stuff on. So we'll test it on this dummy. <laughs> I think I need to hold it. Yeah, so the boomerang comes back when you use it, but you do need to hold it for a bit. I guess it charges like a bow, I would say. Uh, I don't know how much damage it does. I don't know how much any of these damages do. Um, this is dynamite, and yes, it does do damage. I'm just gonna say that now, so I'm gonna quickly change your game rule. <laughs> um, uh, I need. I think I went past it. Um, I think it's this one. No, I know what that one is. Um, I need... Mob griefing? I... I don't know if this counts as mob, but I'll put it on anyway. Um, um, and we'll give it a go. If I block the house, I'll just re-add it. Um, I'm not super fussed about the house. So I blocked the house. Um, yeah. That's gonna need some work. Um, yeah, but you just basically throw it uh, like a grenade. It's like a grenade. It has, I believe, half the radius of a TNT. And you actually get two when you craft it. Uh, craft one. Well, when you do the crafting recipe, you get two. Um, yeah. I've lost sections of my house, but I'll come back and fix that at some point. Um, <laughs> back to the basement, or what I consider to be the basement. Uh, there's this thing, a javelin, <laughs> which we all know what a javelin is, it's pretty much a spear. You get two of them, and you charge them like that. Um, Uh, yeah, now we're getting onto the uh, ranged weapons. Why this guy is, uh, this guy is, you know, just chilling there. <laughs> Jump shot! Yay! Um, yep. Yeah. Um, this is how you make a gun stock, which is the base of both the ranged weapons in here. Um, then you take a musket for the musket one, which is that. Um, and you just basically attach them together, top and bottom, and then you get this one. I'll put these back. And then optional, you can as long as it's not broken at all, or the knife is not broken at all, you can tie them together. And then you get a bowie that does, um, bowie that does, like, three points stabbing. Um, and as long as you have some ammo, as a short, as you saw in the little beginning bit, you, no, oh, I don't want to trade. That's quite a good trade. Um, <laughs> you hold right click and then you reload. You hear a click, and for some reason in here it doesn't do this in tech it, but it automatically puts you in your firing mode. If you want to quickly switch out your firing mode, hit any of the other keys, or if you're lucky enough to own a mouse, just hit the ball up or down. And I don't want to, I want to kill you. And you can one shot people with this. Like that. But, uh, yeah, I believe the knife does three points of damage. I believe. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know for certain, but it does more than just punching it with a normal bayonet. Uh, bayonet. A normal, uh, musket. Uh, yeah, that's how you make the musket rounds. It's, uh, iron, go, uh, go. Uh, gunpowder and paper. I probably should have mentioned that for all the recipes, but yeah, 
Uh, next weapon is the crossbow, which is just simply a bow with four iron and two wood. That has to be fully repaired. So, the crossbow. I have no ammo for the crossbow. Yeah. I'll take the ammo there. The ammo is a single piece of ingot and a feather, and you get four rounds for it. So, if you. Uh... <laughs> That's not a very good example. It does the same thing as the musket. You hold right click and do with the thingy. It reloads a lot faster than the musket. And it does drop like normal arrows, but yeah. The crossbow is what I'd recommend if you're not for a range type person and you do like to. Well, you, you want to use range, but you don't want to use a gun. Uh, the next thing's the blow dart. Um, and that's the blow dart rest. Uh, like, ammunition, you get four per each as a stick, cactus, feather. Uh, the blow dart poisons, I believe, I believe it's, I believe it poisons. Yeah, poisonous dart. Um, and you get a really cool sound effect, I did, I did not know about that. Um, yeah, it poisons, poisons them, and I'm just going to let them die if they do. Ow! Ow! Ah! Oh god! Oh god, where's the milk when I needed? Oh god, that hurts! Oh, I'm fine. Um, so apparently if you shoot them while they're poisoned, it goes back towards you. Uh, <laughs> so be careful with that one. Um, yes. And look, he's dead. Um, yeah, the blow, the blow gun is quite good. Um, for me, it's more like tribal themed, which I don't really like. But it's just free sugar cane, so it's not that bad. And if you're going to use that, you need that. <laughs> um, this is the Blunder Burster, which is basically a shotgun. You use the same gun stock as the one I showed you earlier, and you build it this shape. So it uses all the same ingredients as the musket, just in different formats. And um, yeah, this one makes use of gravel instead of steel, so it's just gun um, gravel, gunpowder and paper, and you get your musket shots, um, your finger shots. And uh, like I said, this one's a shotgun. So if I spawn in multiple. Oh god damn it, move! Fine, I'll just blow you all up. Um, yeah, it's a shotgun, so. I'm surprised they didn't die. Um, see, yeah, it hits multiple. Um, more than one at a time. And um, all the charging does on this one is give you a uh, better range at long distances. Um, so it'll do more damage at close distance, but you don't really need that when you've got um, certain thingies. Oh, don't want to do that. I just want to stick it in here because I no longer need it. Uh, just quickly give me a second. Uh, and the next thing's a fire rod, which I need pigs. I need pigs. Do I have too many items anymore? No, I don't have too many items anymore. Uh, I'll quickly switch to creative mode. Oh wait, I could just... Can I spawn a pig? No, okay, I can't spawn pigs. <laughs> I'm so used to, like, you know... Servers and single player commands. <laughs> Put the piggies in there. Pig! Ah! Pig! Ah! Pig! No! Pig! Yay, piggy! Ah. Piggy! Piggy! I want to stab you with this fire! And it's got a cool particle, particle effect. Stab him with the fire! Stab him with the fire. Ah! No! Uh. Yeah, it's got one use, but it will cook a pig alive. And I believe if it dies, it will drop its cook steak. Yeah, it's dead. So it dropped cook steak. Yeah, it dropped cook steak, as you can see there. So it it has a use. It's not terribly bad. It has a use. Um, bit there. The next thing is the cannon. I've got the cannon set up, so I'm not taking that. But here's how you make the cannonballs. And oh, no, I need them. I need them. I need them. Um, yeah. 
you need cannonballs and gunpowder with this, although it's not in the crafting recipe. But if you head upstairs, which I'm about to do, and it's night already. <laughs> wow, have I really been doing this for that long? Um, I put it on the diving board just because it seemed like a suitable place. I'm not going to dive off this anytime soon. So you right click to get on it, and you right click to place it, and it's quite a cool cannon. Uh, and it, I don't know why that bug that keeps happening. But uh, you get a cannonball, you right click on the cannon with a cannonball, and I'm going to do it over here because it might kick me off. Yeah, okay. But um, <laughs> once you've done that, I don't actually know how to fire it. In Tech It, you just aimed somewhere and right clicked, but I don't know now. Unless it's something to do with the gunpowder. Um, I tried flint and steel on this. I even tried flint, just flint. I tried a torch. Um, but I really don't know how to fire this. So I'm sorry, I can't show you what it does. Um, I'd block the roof if I could, just to show you how much damage it does. <laughs> um, but I really just no idea how to uh, how to with a painting. How to uh, yeah fire it, but you do need one gunpowder and one ball per. Shut up! One gunpowder and one ball to uh, use it. And then there's this dummy, the last thing, the the training dummy that I shot at. It's um just a piece of leather, wheat, wool, and a stick. And you just go around, and place them, right click anywhere. If it's but oh, and uh, you can't destroy them. You cannot destroy them. Not even in creative. Um, the only way I know of destroying them is to drop an anvil or something on top of them. I think I don't have an anvil on me. Um, but one last thing: almost all the weapons can be enchanted. So um, check them out. Uh, this is not all the weapons can be enchanted. I don't think, but uh, I've named some of them as well. <laughs> um, these are hacked enchantments. So yeah. Looting 5 doesn't even exist. Because um, if I kill this piggy with this looting thing, I should get a lot of meat. Oh, I love me meat. Ah, oh, he's glitched in the floor. Fucking piggy! <laughs> Why am I only getting... You know what? Let's go mental. <laughs> Let's kill these piggies. Um, I think there's a f few things I probably forgot to mention, but this does work on multiplayer, this mod, so um, yeah, if you enjoy this mod, go over to the person who made it and say that you like it, and I'm lagging really badly. <laughs> oh my god, the TNT broke the window. Um, but yeah, check out the mod, check out the guy that made this brilliant house, and thank him for me. Uh, thank him with all my heart. Well, mine, I say yours. And I'm going to go for a dip in the pool. So I'll see you guys next time as I drown. Bye-bye. Da-da-da-da.